7412 Chesapeake. It's low, very low traffic, quiet, all well kept houses. Both neighbors are well kept. The roof definitely already has multiple layers of shingles. Um, I think it needs a new roof to be honest. On the other side there's a patched spot. There's a few spots where the brick has actually shifted. That's about, that pops out about three quarters of an inch. All wooden windows, including the basement, it's like 25 windows. A parking pad here where you see my car, and the driveway that goes all the way back from the street to this one car garage. Spot, a damaged spot in the back on this roof. Can't get inside, they've cut off the door there. Uh, I haven't tried this actually. And then, I think that's the neighbor's shed. So see on this side of the roof, there's more damage. The structure itself looks all right though. The roof looks a little bit wavy to me. Uh, there's moss spots. And then here you can see there's a different color patch. And your driveway has some cracks, but for the most part it's pretty level and good. This side, there's no real visible shifting or cracks in the brick. This deck's old. Uh, we could maybe repair it, but I think we should build a new one. Uh, this set of stairs. Oh, I still see it. No. Looks pretty good. Here's your front door. I didn't walk up the front porch, but it definitely needs to be replaced as well. Here's your front door, you have this small paneled area. And you walk through to a big living area
first thing to your right here is a bedroom. And in between this big open area and the kitchen is a staircase to the basement. Here's your kitchen. Off the back of the kitchen, there's a half bathroom. Or actually a full bath. And also a bedroom. There's no central air duct work. <laughs> Only baseboard heat. And off the living area, there's a full bathroom and first the bedroom. One, this is the third bedroom on this floor. It's all drywall in here. Textured ceilings. They got wallpaper on now. All the windows match. They're pretty old, beat up wood. And then this bathroom. Which kind of seems out of place here. Attic access here. It's definitely not a tall enough area to do anything with. I'm just looking at the roof mainly. I'm right where the patch was from the outside, and there's no visible moisture or damage on the inside. Don't see. And the basement. I measured anywhere from six kind of slanted from 6'6 six, six on one end to 6'8 on the other so it's a big space but just barely a little bit short electric panel it's only 100 amps Hot water heater, it's copper plumbing, and a way outdated heat source. Um, they had a bathroom framed in over here. Well, half bath, no shower. And a bedroom that they framed in, but it looks like got water damaged, all the drywalls all over the floor. The foundation that is exposed, which most of it is, uh, there's not any visible cracks or shifting. All the floor joists look pretty good and a sump pump. But there's no French drains.